Yup. Once again, you motherfuckers know what it is. The realness from the streets. Yes, it is. And this is an addition of hoods and blocks where we come to you with some real shit. We're gonna take you through a little bit of what I call my own fucking background. The blocks, the streets, the motherfucking shit where I wipe my little ass at, comb my little nappy hair. Got it wrong and definitely got it right. So I want you to watch this journey and take this trip with me and get a little better understanding of some of the shit I went through, some of the places I laid my fucking head, done dirt, and did some clean shit. I wasn't always uh, just a badass like you might think I am. But I definitely got it in through these parts. And this shit around here made me a man. So keep checking this shit out. As we walk on through, not walk on back. And maybe we will kick it with a motherfucker or two. Just to gain some understanding of these blocks. These blocks were my little bad nappy head ass came from. You heard? Yeah, this is hoods and blocks. And we taking some real shit to you. Motherfucking nigga right hey, here. What's, what's up, up man? My nigga? What's up, man? You all right, wrong baby? Wrong hand, though, goddamn it. But it's all right. Everything all right. You goddamn yeah, right. Yeah, your hand is the wrong one. <laughs> I fucked up. Yeah, that's everything good. You all right, baby? Hell yeah. What's going on I ain't with you? too much, man. Gonna take my ass uh, around this corner and tell you about this shit. What's happening around here, man? Okay. Okay, that's yeah. what's up. Yeah, cause we you know we we just gonna kick it a little bit about some shit around this motherfucking park. Yeah, some cool ass shit around here, boy. Okay, okay. Set my for life. That's right, that's right, that's right. Mm -hmm. That's right, set my motherfucking life. Thug from the BKs on up, baby. Y'all heard it. Thug heard from it right the BKs here. on up. Throw your signs up, goddammit. Black killer for life. See that B in the K? Black killer. East side. Y'all heard that Stop shit, man. Y'all heard that shit, Trust right? That's right, that's right. And this is the motherfucking yeah, place. Big we do it. Damn gigantic. Hell yeah. So what you grown, did you, you did you grow up in this motherfucking area around here? <coughs> this is my street right here, Hannah. H-A-N-N-A. -N -N -A. Okay. One of the brutalest motherfuckers out here. And then, but I don't want to keep saying too much on there. That's right. Ain't everybody business. 
It ain't every motherfucking body business what went down on this motherfucking down. block, huh? This is a brutal neighborhood, y'all. Right. Trust me. Right. It's a street I grew up on since, since back in 1966. I'm still over here. So since the 60s and now, do you see any difference in the shit that, that goes on? Hell yeah, it's called Weapon to the Ghetto. That's right. So you was in the ghetto when you fuck around in the D. So right. You know, but you got damn ghetto. Would you say? Would you say the whole, the, the whole, whole motherfucking down. city is a ghetto? The whole motherfucking city is a ghetto. Okay. Shit turns around like a motherfucker around here. Mm-hmm. Did, did the shit? Did the shit turn around real, real quick, or real. not? It took its time, but it turns around. Okay. It turned around like a motherfucker. You see how it looks? Throw out and wore out. Right. Nothing but the motherfucking goddamn swamp. Right. And just by the bitch. Now, I'm dude. Over here, I was six years old. She was beautiful, y'all. And again, you had you you, you had you had recreation, you had every goddamn thing. No when junior high used to jump with swimming. I was seven years old, learning how to swim in motherfucking in the deep water. Damn. Now nigga can't go goddamn man, get in no goddamn water. Can't get in the shit around. Ain't no this pool around this motherfucker. Yeah, I remember then they used to have what they called a swimmobile or something. Didn't yeah, they? I, I ain't fuck with that back in the day because it's too small for me. Right. There ain't right. nothing but the back of a truck. Right, right. Well, did, did people actually have pools? They bought pools around here? No, we used to go to Northern Junior High and swim. Okay. They swim seven in days a motherfucking week. Seven days a week. Um, all folk seasons. Damn. Even midwinter. We love it. We ain't give a fuck. So school was good in the hood. Back in the day. Back in the day. Back in the day. So you would say now school has pretty much changed now. School, yeah. It ain't the same. It ain't nothing the same. Not, not in the school been passed. Okay. No, that, that's, that's all we You talking about that, no. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. School, what school? Right. Everybody always, you got, you got a fall break right now. We had a corona break. Got a winter break. Spring break. Hey, you know, come on. Right. It's just, you know, yeah, we know, we say Corona fucked up baby thing, we know that. But hey, come on. Look now this... The, but look was, at the hood, though, it's fucked up, y'all. Yeah, the motherfucker, the motherfucker. Yeah, she here. tore and wore out, man. Now this motherfucking lot right here, at one time, I stayed in this motherfucker right here. This lot here. That house or the one here? The lot right here. The, the, you, I, we had a house right there, mm. but they tore that motherfucker down. I know I already know what that came behind. With the, with, the, with the big gutters. Right. So what would you say, what, what what do you think made all this shit end up being like this? Shit, we got shit, uh, I ain't gonna tell you, but um, we just got broke and motherfuckers just went to do what they gotta do. So you say poverty, motherfuckers poverty. just, yeah. Poverty, yeah. No education, lack like of education. I like a job like back in the then. Now they got job, cause ain't nobody wanna work them now. But back then, wasn't no job. So you heard it. Yeah. You heard it. You that's heard why, it. That's why the neighborhood got towed down. Right. Because you all know what's, what happened back in the day. Right. You know, hey, we had jobs and fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. Detroit was one of the richest motherfucking states in the country. One of the richest cities, yeah. That's the richest city it is in, in the country. Right. Right. And But now, the poets. Right. And welcome to my ghetto. Well, they trying to do a little something, but it ain't in the neighborhoods. Downtown. Everything is downtown Everything being downtown. built up. Right. So they not yeah. investing in the communities like they should. Yeah, we don't give a damn about the community. Okay. And that's why we you putting know. it on there, letting everybody know. Letting everybody know. But they is doing something, spending seven million, ten million here and there. But they say fuck the northeast side. On the real tip, they say fuck northeast. On the real tip. That's why ain't shit been done around here. All the grass ain't shit been done. Well, do you think they ever gonna make a change with this shit? Well, one day they will. And they gonna, they gonna, they gotta wipe out so much property and you rebuild. They gonna build something. Like on DB side, they should put up some little new shit around there. But other than that, this shit look bad. Okay. It look, it look bad, it's sad, y'all. It ain't bad, it's called, it's called sad. So this shit is damn it's near- drug, drug infested neighborhood shit. This shit is damn near like the survival of the fucking fittest. 
It, it, that's all it is. Would you actually catch yourself walking through this motherfucker at three, four in the morning? Not if I didn't grow up on the street, but I grew right, up on so the street. Right, so yeah, so yeah, yeah you will. trust yourself. Yeah, yeah. Side, I That's how it. I feel, right. Got damn right. right, fuck that. But right now, there's so many new people around here, fuck them, they're gonna get to know me. Right, okay? right. Okay, I'm, I'm still here. Be careful life. Right. Throw y'alls up, y'all. You got damn right. Keep on right. throwing mine, throw y'alls up. You motherfucking right. East side. You right. Fuck that. Now this spot right here. This the house I grew up in. BK did, got, you got damn right. 19231 Hannah. Damn right. I went to hell in there. But it's hell, but it's good though. This is where you became a man in yes, this house I right became here. became a man in this house. You got your stripes I right did, here. I was driving the best it was. Jumping out of Cadillac like it wasn't shit. Slamming Cadillac doors and all that shit. Temple was good. I know that's motherfucking right. But now, look at just the neighborhood now. How you doing? What up? Yeah, I grew up in here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Now, who stayed in this house right here? Do you remember the people the that stayed here? The Harris. They stayed in there for, uh, uh, uh Doc them did. Okay. Larry Harris them, they stayed in there. Ishka Bibble used to stay in that house. Ishka Bibble? Yeah, he stayed in that, 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 that house right there. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now, do you remember when crack first hit this street? Mm-hmm. How was it? How did it impact this neighborhood? That's why I told out the front. It impacted because the motherfucker is the hottest street in the world when crack came out. I wouldn't give a fuck where you live. You be in Flint, Michigan, you going on Hannah. You don't want Detroit where you want to go on Hannah. Did this street you, make millionaires? It made millionaires. Plenty of millionaires grew up on this. This was the street what made them. This street what made them. Made millionaires. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. So there was plenty action going on right here on Hannah. Right here on the corner, right here. Man, shit, they chasing the cars. They dive on cars, whatever it takes. They gonna, they gonna get them customers. Yeah, yeah, they, they chasing cars. They diving on cars. They doing that crazy shit around here. Then they stick you up if you ain't buying from them. They Why? pull out a gun on you. Then you gonna give me your shit anyway, nigga. If you don't know them, that's what they do to you. Okay. You know, they ride them white boys, and they call themselves something dope. <laughs> so, yeah. So, no, this is the life of Hannah, y'all. That's it. You saw all way. You down with it, though. Hey, I'm still here, y'all. I'm 61. Praise the Lord. And he gonna still let me see a couple more years. Quite a few more years. Not no couple, quite a few more. Okay? Mm -hmm. And I'm out. Y'all heard, y'all heard it right from real motherfucking OG. Now this is the block where we came from. When we grew up and had all of our struggles. Motherfucking murder block. This is Detroit, Michigan's east side. Hannah. Y'all make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, that like button. Till the next episode, we out.